What's up guys, Wakey420 here, bringing you some hurricane reports. Better safe than sorry. As you can see, the hurricane coming out through Hurricane Earl. If you guys getting ready here on their boats, this is the Bangor Daily News, September 3rd. We're bringing you down to the boat yard to show you better safe than sorry. Shit going on. Pandemic. You'll know yeah. you know. Father's boat. Bringing 36 H and H, ain't it? Yeah, 37. Mm -hmm. 37 pod. Slippery 30. With a beautiful western style house. Yeah. <laughs> one, one, two, three, four, five. 15 boats right here, folks. Pulled right out of the hole. Looks like goddamn boat, yeah. IP was good enough to lend the truck out to let everybody pull. Please don't prank call the number. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, don't prank call them. If you want to order a yeah. decent boat, well, that right there is a IP. That's a nice looking boat. You got the right one, baby. That's an H and H. H and H. Boat piled up. We're ready to go. And then in the middle of it all, folks, the biggest <laughs> boat you've ever seen, the Splinter. The old hardcore. Right out of water, folks. If you want to buy this boat, you can buy it. $120,000. Glass overboard, 160 coming in. 120 grand. I'll pile with it right now. <laughs> you can have it. I'll fucking drive it right out to you. <laughs> nice foggy night here, you wouldn't think. They're only giving like. They did have it as a category 4 hurricane coming our way. 120 mile an hour winds. Everybody got right paranoid. Pulled all their boats. As you can see, 6 o'clock this morning on the high water, it looks like a goddamn madhouse down here. All you saw was jack stands and black blocks, fucking flying trucks in and out. There was some shit happening at 6 o'clock. We'll, we'll show you some hurricane footage. We'll, sh we'll show you a little relaunch footage, too. Might even but, get Dylan of Dylan Outdoors yeah. to walk you through a little By bit the of way, this. congratulations <laughs> to Dylan Johnson, Dylan Outdoors. He's expecting. I bet it's going to be a little dill pickle. The old peer pressure. I think what I'm going to do is just leave my boat right here so they can't launch their boats just to piss them off. They're fancy straight in here. Is where we're getting pulled out of. Beauty little ramp. We are ready. We ain't got to worry about our boat fucking packing more and getting sunk or anything. Now they're giving up 90 miles an hour and now they're only giving tropical storms all we're expecting to get so it's better safe than sorry. Headline, Bangor Daily News is all I gotta say. I've heard that at least 650 times and I've said it probably 30. Give you some hurricane footage here. Probably it won't be shit or only, well, we're gonna get at least 15 foot seas outside. And we were looking at like 80 mile an hour winds, but now we're only looking at like 55, so. We think this might have been a little bit overzealous of a precaution, but IP was good enough to bum the truck out. And kind of a community effort to get everyone all set for this hurricane and we're gonna ride her out right here and not have to worry about a goddamn thing. So. Oh, might as fucking well. No sense in have to come check on your boat every fucking hour and a half. <coughs> no babysitting. The boat's called Danau, which in down east terms is kind of like, I don't know. You know, saying Danau. Well, this man had his son painting this on his boat. 
loved it just as proud as he could be about getting this new paint job this was christ 20 years ago he's riding out and somebody's on the radio and they go who's got the boat named porno who would name the boat porno like that just because the way the d looks kind of like a p that got him so fucking pissed off on the radio when he wound right up I can just as proud as a peacock. His son painted on there, and somebody thought it said porno. Mm -hmm. It it was a never-ending inside joke for quite a while. The old porno instead of dunno. Next time you see it, well, then I cut right here because you're gonna see jumbo. Better safe than sorry. Yeah. You're gonna see what we did all this fucking bullshit for. Hopefully. <laughs> Nothing, because our gear is going to move all the fuck around, but been moving gear all week, getting it in the deeper water, or real shallow water, up inside the bay here, but hopefully we only get 50 mile an hour winds and it won't be too bad, but if we get 100, we're going to find out some quick, we're going to have some tangled up messes, but we're going to show you the footage of old Hurricane Earl. Here we are, hurricane conditions. Not even really that bad, people. We're dealing with 35, gust to 45. There's the Isle of Shoals. There's our cove. Not a boat in it. Ain't getting soaked for this, so. You can see better safe than sorry once again. We're on the shore. A lot of rain. Hurricane Earl, you're a goddamn pussy. That's all you got. Ain't much. Go check on the boats. This is where the boats would be if they were on the morning. Get some heavy rain, tropical winds, and I'd say some overzealous precaution on um, on precaution so yeah. bring on Fiona yes <laughs> Earl's a pussy